Hey, what's up everybody? It's Jed Johnson. I've been asked to do a gym tour of my gym. And I really appreciate everybody's interest in, in my gym. I think that's pretty cool. So I'm going to do like a quick walkthrough right now. And what I thought is if there's anything that you see that you don't know what it is, you can let me know what time it comes up in the video and I can make sure when I go over uh, that stuff that I make sure to highlight exactly what you are looking at, what you have a question about, okay? So I train in a two car garage. Here's the door that I just walked into. And if we go right straight forward, I have my lat pull down, tricep push down machine, sled, sandbag, recycling container, uh, some chairs, a couple grip machines back there. I haven't used those in a while, so they're just back out of the way. Got some weight trees. You can see a bunch of block weights there, my hundreds and some of my, uh, my hub plates. You can see some standard plates inch dumbbell, more weight trees. I have um, the seated uh, military press machine that I have used in the past quite frequently but as of the last few months haven't used it too much. Some ropes, sledgehammers, kettlebells. This is a rack that is not very organized yet but uh, maybe one day it will be when I do the video of this section. Um, this is my gripper cabinet that my partner Luke built for me. It's fantastic. Really appreciate it. This is the another weight tree. Some dumbbells. My dumbbell collection has outgrown my dumbbell rack. So a lot of my dumbbells just end up hanging out on the floor. So I'm always looking for you know new racks and stuff like that. So one day I'll have enough racks for all these dumbbells. But Right now, I'm not too worried about it. My banner. <clears throat> uh, this is a, a barbell rack that my good friend Joe made for me. It says diesel down there. I don't know if you can see it. It holds barbells. My Saxon bar, things like that. Then I've got this uh, pegboard area that I hang stuff on. You'll see in some videos that stuff gets moved around. There used to be all my grippers here on the pegboard, but I don't keep them there anymore. I keep them in that cabinet. They were even in a different spot in between all that in another room that we're not going to look at right now. My squat cage here. <clears throat> Bunch of grip tools, rolling thunders and things like that. Another weight tree. This was a homemade box squat platform that we made. My partner, or uh, former partner, we used to train together a lot. Uh, Eli Thomas, still a good friend, made that in about five minutes before a workout one day. Glue ham, more pegboard, speed bag, Swiss ball up there in the corner. That's a platform I use for pulling against band resistance. Strongman platform some block weights, entertainment area. There's uh, water bottles in that red cooler there. The red bag with the red hoodie on it, that's my travel bag. So when I go somewhere, generally I take that with me anywhere. I go, use a lot of bands in my training. I just keep them hooked up on the on the on these, these pillars here. <clears throat> See the med ball in the back. This is a, the, the orange streamers are a target for people to hit. We do some med ball throws and stuff like that. So that is just a quick token tour of the gym. Now the other request that I got is to actually explain what everything is. So I will begin doing that. But like I said, if there's anything that you are particularly interested in or confused about, be sure to let me know. Um, and I will go over that in more detail later on. But I hope you've enjoyed this, this preliminary tour. We're going to go through things in more detail later on. So make sure to stay tuned and subscribe if you haven't yet. All right, all the best in your training, guys. Take care.
and check out uh, dieselcrew.com, my website for the latest articles, videos, all kinds of different stuff up on the site. All right, all the best. See ya.